Today, let's write our first PHP program and see some simple worst practices that we can avoid to become a better PHP programmer. First, let's switch on our BAMP server, open the notepad, and note that the file name must end with .php extension, otherwise the parser cannot parse the PHP codes. We can embed PHP inside HTML or HTML inside PHP, but name file name must have .php extension. Today let's see how to embed PHP inside HTML tags. Let's write the HTML skeleton. Let's give it a title as PHP info because that is what we are going to see today. Some people use opening angular bracket question mark and some PHP quotes followed by question mark and closing angular bracket. Some people even use the ASP style of writing PHP that is opening angular bracket percentage symbol percentage symbol and closing angular bracket and whole lot of other things like question mark equals percentage equals etc. All these may work on your computer or some of these may work on your computer but that is because of the way your PHP INI file is configured but the same file may not work on other servers so the best practice is to stick with opening angular bracket question mark PHP PHP then writing some our PHP codes and then question mark closing angular bracket as you can see here also note that white space is not significant in PHP you can introduce any number of space tab new line character inside these PHP tags. So let's write our first PHP program. Opening angular bracket question mark PHP space PHP info I N F O opening parenthesis closing parenthesis question mark closing angular bracket. You can introduce space for indentation purpose save the file open the web browser locate your file on your local host we saved it with php info.php file name so it's working so it gives a lot of information php version 5.3.0 that i am using we can locate php ini file on our computer it gives a whole lot of information about our server as well as the PHP that we have installed. We can see if our error reporting is turned on or off. We can usually see it in this code section where it is turned on. Good to turn it on while you are developing and turn it off while you are releasing it to the general public. Thank you.